knot using some Lee Stafford products. Now for me, a top knot is much, much easier on either second day or third day hair. It's always easier if I've kind of styled it already so it's kind of got some curls from the day before. First thing I'm gonna do is just spray some dry shampoo through my hair. Now this is really good for volume, grip and texture. It also kind of freshens your hair up a little bit. As you can see, it's just giving it a bit extra there. And then I'm also going to spray it through some Beach Babe Sea Salt Spray. Now this again is just really good for texture. You don't want to spray too much because you don't want your hair to feel wet. But just spray that through the end and scrunch it in. And you'll just get a nice bit of texture in there as well. A top knot is better when it's slightly messy and not too neat. So I'm just going to use um, a little brush to just kind of get rid of the lumps and bumps. But I'm not going to have it really, really neat and tight to my head. First thing that I'm going to do is just scoop my head back. I'm just going to turn to the side here, get the ponytail where I want the top knot. So, lean your head back, just give that a bit of a rub, and just scoop all that hair right to the top of your head. So grabbing my polishing brush here, I'm just going to smooth over underneath of my hair, just to kind of make that a little bit neater. And then with your bobble already on your wrist, you want to literally just pull that ponytail right through, and then as you get to the end, just there, you want to twist the bobble and then go back on yourself. So you don't want to pull that ponytail all the way through. And then just grab those little bits and as you go around, just make sure they're more secure in the bobble. And then you've got your kind of bun shape there. So you just want to use this time just to pull out any bits of the hair that you don't want too tight into the ponytail. So you want to kind of use this time just to loosen those up. You want to just loosen this back bit up as well because that's kind of where you get your top knot effect from. So you don't want that too tight in there. And obviously we don't want our top knot to look like this. So grab in some curvy grips. You just want to grab the top knot and your curvy grip, put the curvy grip into the top knot, drag it back and then put it back into your hair. So effectively you're kind of putting the grip back on itself. And then just one at this side as well just to kind of make that shape a little bit more nicer. Put that in there and then you can kind of just lift that up a little bit just tuck bits in kind of just play around with it a little bit i guess some more grips you can just pop those in wherever you need them just want to spritz through some hairspray just to keep that in place this is the fat flexible hold hairspray my all-time favorite because it doesn't go crispy or crunchy or very hard but it does keep your hair in place which is perfect so so I lightly spray that over the top knot itself. There you go guys, there is the perfect messy top knot. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you do attempt this look, then make sure you tweet both me and Lee. Both our Twitter handles can be found below. Make sure you give this video a nice big thumbs up and leave your comments below and I'll see you again soon for another video. Bye!